What is photogrammetry? In breaking down the word photogrammetry, we get photo, which means light, gram, which means drawing, and metry, which means measurement. Photogrammetry is the extraction of three-dimensional measurements from two-dimensional data. This data typically comes in the form of photographs. In basic terms, photogrammetry is a process that uses photography for measurement. Photogrammetry is used in many different industries. It's used in geomatics to produce accurate geographical image maps using aerial photographs. This is like the satellite photography you'd see on an application such as Google Earth. For cultural heritage, photogrammetry is used to preserve historical monuments, buildings, and culturally significant subjects such as underwater shipwrecks. As an example, SciArc is a company that helps conserve historical sites through 3D documentation. This is important because these historical places are decaying and they won't last forever. In game design and film production, photogrammetry is used to create 3D assets. During the development of the video game, The Vanishing of Ethan Carter, photogrammetry was used to create an immersive and photorealistic experience. 3D statues, buildings, and natural elements such as rocks were created from images. In the following tutorial series, we're going to focus on 3D reconstruction from multiple images. This will involve taking pictures with a handheld camera from many angles. We will be utilizing photogrammetry for artistic multimedia content creation. With the increasing power and availability of cameras and computers, 3D reconstruction is becoming more accessible. With more accessibility comes more opportunity to experiment. Photogrammetry is a relatively unexplored medium. This means it's an opportunity to create something new. Traditional photography limits us to a two-dimensional viewing experience. What if we were to remove that boundary? What if a photograph became something that's unbounded by the scope of a frame? This is why I'm so passionate about photogrammetry. The way I see it, illustrative photogrammetry is a multimedia evolution. Together, in future videos, we're going to explore the vast potential that this emerging medium offers. We're going to get started by learning the tips and tricks on how to capture good images for a quality 3D model. Then, we're going to take those pictures and process them using a photogrammetry software. Finally, we're going to clean up our resulting model and find ways to publish it online. These tutorials are designed to get you started with photogrammetry and serve as a basic foundation. Throughout the series, I will break down the fundamental steps on how to create a quality 3D model. Together, we'll think about what makes a good photogrammetric composition. In these videos, we're going to view photogrammetry less for its scientific applications and more for its artistic ones. In the upcoming video series, we'll be figuring out what you need to begin working with photogrammetry. Check out the video description for anything I referenced and for links to the tutorial playlist. Subscribe to my channel to stay updated on the latest creative videos and feel free to comment on my videos to tell me what you think or if you have any questions. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate it.